Okay, all set to go. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Michael Harris. Michael Harris. And a pitch. Swing and a miss, and he was fooled. 0 and 1. Here's a rocket out to left. Sanchez makes the grab, run away. Whit Merrifield up to the plate. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average, but one of the things in today's game, the value in the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Swing and a ball popped up. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. Two down. Here's Yelich at the dish. The left of the 22, Christian Yelich. Ground ball right side. Tosses to the pitcher covering the bag. Yelich out on the bottom of the first. John Birdie at the play. And the pitch. Fastball in for a strike. And it's all one. And that one upstairs. Bows it off. Still one and two. Right-hander kicks, deals. Now, one down. Jazz Chisholm Jr. now. And the first pitch misses for ball one. That clips the inside corner for a strike. This one in the air right field. Clemente makes the grab, and there's two gone. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. Luis Arias stands in now and watches strike one. Ripped on a line. Drops in for a hit. Couldn't run it down. And he's in at second with a two-out double. I love the approach he had right there with that pitch. Not trying to do too much, but still looking to drive it. And that's exactly what he's able to do into the opposite field gap for the double. Well, they're looking to get on the board first here after that clutch two-out double made this inning interesting. A rise. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And we're back. Top of the second. Stepping in the long ball threat, Rafael Palmero. Palmero. As he turns on the rubber with that good live arm delivery. And that gets the inside corner for a strike. That one pulled foul. And that's in the dirt. Two strikes. Foul ball still, a one and two count. And now the lefty. And another ball. Well, this is a guy that can be frustrating for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at-bat. I'm sure there's some times where a pitcher would probably just give up a first pitch single and have to waste six or seven pitches on one hitter. Well, that may end up being an at-bat we go back to later on when this game is over. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. In the air, left field, Sanchez sizes this one up, calls it in for the out. Good pitch. He just kind of had him out in front on that pitch away and wasn't able to stay close. Here's the shortstop at the play, Hassan Kim. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Oh, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. This one lifted in the air, left field. Pulls it in, and there's two away. Here's Alex Bregman. That, 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 that. The third baseman of the two. Alex Bregman. First yep, pitch misses. Ripped to short. Off balance throw in time. And that is the inning. Back here at Low Depot Park. Go, 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 go. And now the first baseman, Josh first Bell. Baseman. Yeah. On the ground, right side. Yeah. Merrifield. In plenty of time to first. That's one out the bottom of the second. 
Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. In the air, right field. Pretty well struck. That one is back. Out of here. He circles the bases. It's 1-0. One, one down. And up next for Miami, Brian De La Cruz. Fastball for a strike. 1-1. One, one. Hard on the ground at first. And he takes it himself for the out. Two outs, base is empty. And now here's the Marlins DH, Whoa, Nick here. Gordon. First offering, and it just misses. Two outs, base is empty. Next offering is in for a strike. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes, and that ends the inning. We're back, and on the mound is the closer, Tanner Scott. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves. Late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. Now it's the right fielder, Roberto Clemente. What are you looking to do in these spots? You're down a run. You're leading off the inning. He's not a power hitter, a guy that's looking to tie it up with one swing. So he's going to take and get into this at bat and try to get deep into the bat, ultimately, however he can, get to first base. Looking to get the tying run on base. Berger. Tosses across oh. the first. That takes care of Clemente. And here's the catcher, Jonah Heim. First pitch just misses. Bounced up the middle. Birdie. Tosses to first. First two batters retired here in the top of the third. So they're down to their final out. And here is Michael Harris. He's all for one. Hit to second, and this should do it. Throw to first is in time, and that'll do it. The Marlins claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. And a 1-0 count.